Transfer News January 27, Man United Difficult to Buy Monaco Star Man United Difficult to Buy Monaco Star, three clubs willing to buy back Almo's contract, are the notable transfer news in the past 24 hours. Eric Ten Hag's plan to pull Axel Disaisai to Mew in the winter transfer window of 2023 is facing many difficulties. Accordingly, the Monaco side announced that it would not sell Disaisai in January this year. Tottenham are in talks to sign Sporting Lisbon's Pedro Porro. The North London team are ready to spend £40 million to own this right back. Currently, the Portuguese club has not responded to the partner. Chelsea along with Barcelona and Adeltico are the teams vying for the signature of midfielder Dani Almo. All three are ready to release the Spain internationals contract with RB Leipzig, worth about €75 million Euros in the summer of 2023. Youngster Charlie Savage has completed his medical to join League One side Forest Green on loan. The agreement between the parties shall not include an outright purchase clause. Atletico Madrid want the services of Ferran Torres if Yannick Carrasco arrives at Barcelona. Most likely, Atletico will spend a sum of money with Carrasco to get Torres. Korean striker Oh Hyeon Jiu officially parted ways with Suwon Blue Wings to join Celtic on a five-year contract. The Scottish club had to spend £2.5 million to buy him. Martin Zubimendi became a hot name in the winter transfer window. The 23-year-old midfielder caught the eye of many old continental teams, including Arsenal and Barcelona. According to Metro, Real Sociedad only agrees to release people if Arsenal put 60 million euros on the negotiating table, contract release fee. According to Corriere dello Sport, Arsenal have rushed into the race to sign midfielder Weston McKennie. Coach Arteta wants to strengthen the midfield for the Premier League title race after having many players injured in this area. Arsenal's biggest rival in the race for McKenney is Leeds. Everton are very interested in signing Hakim Ziyech, who is in danger of losing his place at Chelsea after the arrivals of two newcomers Mikhailo Mudrik and Noni Maduik. BLD Barcelona is planning to let midfielder Pablo Torre join another team for the rest of the season on loan. Since being bought from Racing Santander last year, Torre has played very few times. The representative of right-back Denzel Dumfries on the payroll of Inter Milan club has left for England to negotiate with partners willing to accept his clients. According to Gazeta dello Sport, the teams that are interested in Dumfries include Man United, Chelsea and Newcastle. The Daily Mail reported that BLD Lyon has contacted Tottenham's partners to ask to borrow right-back DJED Spence. If they win Spence, they are ready to let Malo Gusto move elsewhere. Midfielder Deici Comita of Eintracht Frankfurt is facing the opportunity to go to Spain to play football, because he has been in the sights of Barca's board of directors. In addition to Barca, in the list of teams that are eyeing Comita, there is also Dortmund. Striker Wout Weghorst revealed he is very confident in the possibility of being bought permanently by Man United at the end of the season. Weghorst is being borrowed by Mew from Burnley, he has just scored one goal to help the Red Devils crush Nottingham Forest 3-0 in the English League Cup. Young defender Lewis Payne has just signed a new contract with Southampton until the summer of 2025. Payne is only 18 years old this year but has been in the Southampton ranks for nine years.